So good afternoon everyone. Today is a video on making a length frequency histogram in Excel. Um, there are a few things that you'll need to do to make sure that they come out right. Um, so here's just some data that I had lying around to show you what's going on here. So we have our species and our lengths in millimeters. So species are smallmouth bass, largemouth bass, black crappie, pumpkin seed, and yellow perch. Um, I have taken all of the lengths that we got for each of our fish, as you can see here, and put them in order from smallest to largest. Um, the way you do that is you just highlight the section. It could be randomized. Um, let me make a random one. Four, seven, eight, two, one, five, whatever. So you're going to highlight this. You can go to sort and filter, smallest to largest. It does that. Sometimes when you have some other things going on, it may ask you to expand the selection. So you're going to say, no, you're only going to continue with the current selection because it's going to do a whole bunch of other stuff and you just want to make sure it does this little area. So we're going to sort that, which had, didn't really do anything because we already had it sorted, but that's how you would do that. So first you're going to want to make a bin. These bins are going to be in different numbers, so it could go by fives, it could go by tens, so we're gonna probably go by tens because we have some pretty large numbers when it comes to our smallmouth bass. Um, you can do different bins for different fish, but to make it easier, I always just do it this way. So uh, 10, 20, 30, and we're gonna take this and I'm gonna drag it down by the corner with that black crosshair. I'm gonna bring it up to about 450, so we go over the number that we currently have, which is 439 is our highest. So that's going to be our bin right there. Keep that in mind. Some of you may already have this downloaded on your computer, but you're going to want it the data analysis tool pack. So in Excel, you're going to go into tools, maybe different on some other computers. I do have a Mac, so it might look a little different, but this is how it goes. Excel add-ons, you're going to do the analysis tool pack. I already have it downloaded. I don't need it again, but you're going to just check that. Um, I'm unsure of how you do it in Microsoft or in Windows programs. Um, but I'm sure Google is your best friend for that. So you're going to hit OK. Cool. We have our data analysis tool pack. The way you tell, if you go to the data tab and go to data analysis. So I'm going to hit data analysis. It gives you a ton of different things you could choose from. Here we're going to do histogram because we're doing length frequency histograms. I'm going to hit OK. So our input range, these are our fish. So you're going to highlight the fish. We're going to do smallmouth bass first. Hit this right here and it'll go back. We're going to do our bin range. Okay, well, we just made our bin. We know I'm going to go from zero all the way to the bottom. You're going to do an output range of where you want your histogram to come out. This looks like a good spot. And you're going to want to hit chart output so you actually get a histogram there. So you're going to hit OK. It's going to do its thing. It does your bin, and then it does your frequency of fish. So how this works is you could do this automatically or you could do it manually. What you're going to do here um, is you have your numbers by tens. Um, so if we have a fish that's 163, just one, it'll go in the 160. If we have none in 70, that's okay. We might have a fish that's in the 380 range. We have two fish in the 390. That's how that goes. When they make you your bins on the histogram feature, it gives you this more column. I delete that. There's no reason to have that. So um, your histogram is right here. You can make it larger. I don't like how this frequency is. Excel does this on its own. If you double click on it, it'll bring you to your axis options. We're going to make it go by two, or the maximum is two because clearly we don't have any more. Or we can do three, well, not 30, three. And this is how much your units are going to go by. I want them to go by one. So it changes that and we have our histogram. So you can X out of that. If you click on the title, highlight it, you can do length frequency histogram, small mouth bass. You can get rid of this frequency thing if you don't want it, just right click on it and delete it. There we go, we got our nice length frequency histogram. This gives us our bin, gives us our frequency of fish. Gonna wanna make sure that you have this. 